Cruising cruising familia today we are in another adventure we are across from the Potomac River this is actually Maryland all the way on that side is Virginia Fort Hunt to be exact and we're out here at Fort Washington this is the defense line right before DC and this is Fort Washington pretty cool and I'm gonna show you guys real quick what this looks like beautiful view gorgeous day today not too sunny a little cloudy perfect to be out here next to these stone uh, building because you know when it's really hot all of this retains the heat so let's go up and show you guys what this place looks like sorry I'm a little winded but I just walked all the way from down there and you know I'm not in the best of shape so let me show you the entrance to this see you guys in a sec all right guys and here we are at the entrance it's a pretty cool spot those windows right there have uh, guns behind them you know they're little small rooms this used to be a drawbridge long 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 time ago and this is the mechanism right here they used to make the drawbridge come up and down <clears throat> but what I like the most out of this spot his future goals got a couple of rooms out here there's not really a lot of information here but I want to say that this was maybe where they put ammo maybe some powder powder cases I have no idea I was thinking maybe this was a jail but it's got a little fireplace so who knows it's not a lot of info old wooden stove old trunk big interior yard and that's what I'm talking about future goals right there that'll be a cool garage it's pretty cool it's a really really big area most of the guns I don't know if they're the original ones are way over there So we'll check those out in a second, but I really want to come down here and check this spot out because it's got double wide doors, super tall. Look like it will be like a, you know, like old barns, vintage houses. Yeah. So I have no idea what this was, but I'm assuming they also had guns here pointing out to the river. It's an awesome view out there. Battery level or water level battery down there. It's got about I want to say it's like maybe 12 of these big barn door cubby holes. It's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I want to say 16 because there's the same amount on the other side. I think it's pretty cool, you know, these big barn doors with the little, little door frame on them. You can tell these are very, very old. <coughs> Here we go with another wooden stove. Smells like people take leaks up in here. Smells like straight urine. But better view right there. Water level battery. Really tall ceilings.
those are the stairs that we just came down from you know i would i wouldn't mind being able to see this like in its heyday i know i probably wouldn't last but this is really nice I wouldn't mind having one of these for my garage. And there you can see the other side. Sorry about that guys, I don't know what happened, it just glitched out. Yeah, pretty cool. Going this one just for the hell of it. Actually, the ceiling looks a lot taller on this one. I wonder what these escape vents were for. Maybe so the powder wouldn't have humidity or it wouldn't get humid, but yeah pretty cool guys I'm sorry I, I see the the video keeps glitching I hope that doesn't show up I don't want to get I don't want you guys to hear me breathing heavy so I'll see you guys in a sec Whew. Jesus yeah I'm out of shape too many damn cheeseburgers so we're out here so every station every one of these stations right here was uh, position for a gun and this is the overlook of the Potomac River beautiful view got the lighthouse way down there guns or cannons got the American flag hoisted on two um, like wooden light light poles but they're upside down but yeah guys there really isn't much to show I know I had a good day out here I had to come and hang out with my well didn't have to I don't mean to sound like that but I wanted to come and spend some time with my fiance you know we both been busy doing other stuff work stuff around the house getting some stuff together you know getting ready for this weather or this season i mean but yeah i have to say there was over 40 guns or cannons on this fort don't quote me on that i know it might be more but there's positions for cannons everywhere on this fort Whew. Here's the only standing, uh, I guess, hoist, cannon hoist, or rotating device. You'll be able actually to be at the end of that wooden thing and, you know, push it either left or right. How did they gauge what degree it had to be? Because I don't see no numbers on the floor or anything. I would like to figure that out pretty cool overlook one two three four five six guns at the bottom and then there's like two underground bunkers one was I was able to go in the other one is gated but yeah pretty cool so Maryland where we're at all the way over there is Virginia and way way over there is DC So yeah, pretty cool spot. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys have an awesome weekend as well. And like I always say, keep on cruising.